back. Let's see, 744. Okay. I hate how you have to break these things up in 10 minute parts. Drives me crazy. I can tell you guys what I'm going to be testing next, and that's uh, malware bytes because it's such a such a f fast one to test. Um, I thought I'd throw that on this weekend as well. I love malware bytes. I use it all the time, along with uh, super anti spyware. Um, okay, it's giving me a 15 day trial. I'm going to buy later. That's nice of them. They don't make me submit anything or anything like that. Gotta admit, uh, the Norton stuff is just beautiful. I mean, their graphics, their interface. I like it kind of like um, Kaspersky. Kaspersky looks really, really good, too, that new version. I'm such a sucker for graphics. But I can tell you, uh, programs with the least amount of graphics can often do the quickest and most uh, damage to any malware infection. I can tell you that. Very quick to load. Very, very deadly. So it's trying to communicate with um, the Symantec server. I, I doubt you'll be able to see this text on YouTube. I don't know how clear it is. But that's what it says. Please wait. Got a little um, hard drive activity down here. More pop-ups. Well, this is, um, I know from testing it earlier this week, this is sort of a pain in the ass, this whole part. You know, contacting the Norton server and downloading their massive update. What would be awesome is if every application would install in safe mode and you could at least, you know, update it and do a manual scan. I just love applications that install in safe mode because you can bypass 90% of, you know, active memory threats. Things that just kind of slow you down. When I go out to my client homes, I, um, I live in safe mode out there. Safe mode with networking and regular safe mode. It just gets me in and out so much faster. So yeah, I could see where this would be kind of boring for someone to watch, but you're seeing exactly how it would go if you had an infected computer and you bought the, went down to your local uh, like Best Buy and and bought this and brought it home and tried to install it. This is kind of what you're gonna what you're gonna face. And don't think for a second that this is a crazy uh, uh, malware infestation. It's not. There's much worse out there, and I see it all the time. PC's kind of frozen at this point. Um, as soon as I kill the network connection, it'll start responding. There's simply so much malware running in real time, or in memory, I'm sorry. Uh, that it's just everything slowed up. You may hear a crying baby in the background. That's my uh, three-month-old 
she's in a bad mood right now. Saturday night is like an excellent night for me to do these reviews, but unfortunately the house is so crazy and everybody's waiting for me to watch a movie and I'm trying to get this done. I'm not being paid for any of this stuff. I mean, I have some advertising on my site and um, that pays for definitely my time doing these reviews and um, updating the site all the time and stuff like that. Um, some companies have been really, really nice in sending me free gifts and things like that. And that's really cool to have that kind of exposure just because I was curious on how these applications run, really. And I thought, well, I always said I'd never upload anything to YouTube, but I guess I'll go ahead and do it. What the hell? And it's really become quite popular. It's neat. It's a lot of fun. Uh, so, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and pause this since all I'm doing is just talking. And uh, when it starts doing something, I'll come back.